This is my family's story, but it is an American story because America is a nation of immigrants. During the late 19-teens and early 1920s, my family escaped the Armenian genocide and ended up in Detroit. Armenian Americans have been really politically active since they came to this country, essentially fighting for recognition and the legitimacy of the struggle. As a young person, that was another way that I sort of experienced politics was through my culture. My dad was a union utility worker. Got to hear a lot about uh, labor unions at the dinner table, which was kind of an unusual thing as a kid. I was just always was really curious about how two sides who really disagreed vehemently on some big issues, how they were able to come together at the end of the day. She was always very inquisitive, always. She really listened to everything everyone was saying and tried to become part of any conversations we had. So don't really remember her being a baby. <laughs> <laughs> we wanted her to understand that she needed to work very hard. Always be honest with people that you were dealing with. Never give up on whatever you want to do. Every day when I walk through the threshold before I get onto the floor of the House of Representatives here at the state capitol in Michigan, I think about my family and our family's story and all of the things that they came to this country for, for security, for a better life for their families, to make sure that they could live with their neighbors in safety. I think about that because those are all the things that I'm really fighting to make sure we still have here in Michigan. I'm Mari Manugian, and I'm running for re-election here in Michigan's 40th House District.